Hi guys, welcome back to another review at Spectre Labs. Today we will be taking a look at the KZ ZS3. The ZS3 cost only $10 and was the third model to be released by KZ for its ZX series of earphones. The ZX series are high performance earphones with an emphasis on strong punchy bass. The ZS3 is not only one of the first models in this series, it is also the most basic one and also one of the most affordable at the moment. It is also available in two versions, one with a built-in microphone and the other without a microphone. An answer button is also included if you choose the microphone version. This button can be used for answering calls or controlling your audio player. Besides that, there are also a few variants when it comes to the casings. There is the glossy black version and there is also a matte black version. It was once available in fake carbon fiber but I find that version to be hard to find these days. This might be because they were unpopular. A key feature of the Zac S3 is the detachable wires. This is a feature normally found on more expensive earphones that usually cost 3 to 4 times more. So to see this feature on a pair of earphones that cost just $10 is quite impressive. One benefit of having detachable wires is that you don't have to replace your earphones if only the wires get damaged for some reason. Detachable wires also allow you to upgrade to wires with better quality. Another benefit is you can convert your Zac X3 into Bluetooth earphones by purchasing a Bluetooth module. The Zac X3 features an all-plastic construction with casings that have a very organic shape. In fact, they actually look a bit like seashells. The idea is that this organic shape fits into your ears better than conventional earphone designs. I actually find these casings to be very comfortable to wear, although this could be a matter of personal preference. The Zac S3, like a few other models in the Zac series, feature over-the-ear wires that help secure the casings to your ears. Although I find this feature works reasonably well, it is again a matter of personal preference. I have read that some other users actually find this feature annoying. This is particularly true for those who wear reading glasses or sunglasses. When wearing glasses, the wire hooks tend to get in the way. Overall, build quality on the Zac S3 isn't too shabby. It does feel a bit cheap and plasticky but then again this is a $10 product. Where it truly shines is in its audio performance. For a pair of earphones that cost only $10, the audio quality is superb. It has quality very similar to earphones from big name brands that cost 3 to 4 times more. The Zac S3 features a single 8mm dynamic drive and has a rather warm and bright audio signature with bass that is reasonably punchy. It may not have multiple drivers or balanced armatures like its more expensive siblings such as the Zac S5 and Zac S6, but for a single dynamic driver earphone, it performs quite well when it comes to audio. If you're upgrading from the standard earphones that were shipped with your smartphone, the Zac S3 is certainly a step up in terms of audio quality. The only thing that is disappointing about it are its plasticky feel and also cheap earbuds. Speaking of earbuds, the ones that come with the Zac S3 are way too soft. If you're thinking of upgrading your Zac S3, one of the first things you should do is to get better earbuds. Overall, the Zac S3 is quite a good pair of earphones for the price of $10. It is something that I highly recommend anyone who is looking for affordable earphones with better audio quality to replace their standard earphones. If you're looking for even better audio quality, then I recommend getting the Zac S5 or Zac S6. These two models cost about 3 to 4 times more than the Zac S3, but they are well worth the price especially if you consider the kind of audio quality these earphones produce. The one thing that the Zac S3 has which is better than any other model in KZX Zac series is the comfort. I feel the shape and size of the Zac S3 is the best of all four Zac series earphones that I've tested so far. Well, that concludes my review of the KZX Zac S3. If you've enjoyed watching this video, please like it. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this in the future. Till the next video, I'll see you again. Goodbye.